Ooh, man, what's good? What's happening? What's popping with y'all, man? It's Tudor and I'm back in the cut. But I'm in a different cut, you know what I'm saying? Today, we got the reaction vid for y'all, man. We got some more football highlights going for the, or going on for y'all, man. We got Cooper DeGene, Ultimate Iowa Highlights, man. Now, if y'all not familiar with the Cooper DeGene, he's a top college prospect, man. Y'all already know. Now, like y'all seen the last few vids, man, we reviewing all the top college prospects coming into the draft right now. Cooper DeGene is one of the top picks for the Seahawks right now, lately. He's been buzzing around. And yeah, man, we're not even going to waste your time, man. We're about to get straight into it. Young blood's a man in motion. Him a Swiss Army knife, man. Simon feels the pressure. That couldn't Hit be far from two, bro. Intercepted. There he is, Cooper DeGene. And he's got some space in front. DeGene still on his feet across the 25. That's kind of fast, DeGene too. is going to take it for a pick six. And this one much better. But yeah, room for DeGene to work. Crowd can sense it. He'd be a good pick, bro. Across Honestly. midfield, breaks the tackle. DeGene down the side. Also, set. if y'all did not know, he's a white nigga, by the way. He also plays corner. One of the very few, very few in the league. Look it up, bro. There ain't too many white corners in the league, bro. Bro is like that. Goodbye. Touchdown, Iowa. Bro is like that. He's taking that bitch to the crib every time. Bounds. Mertz to throw. Mertz picked off. That's a play, bro. And that's a pick. I could have read that from the bro. Let's be honest. That's slow ass. Mertz to throw. Mertz picked off. Bro's a dog. And that's a pick six. Cooper DeGene. Nobody there to stop. I can't see his tackling, bro. I'm trying to see his tackling. Back to number one thing that doesn't help when you have an offensive line that can't capture the line of scrimmage and can't run the ball. It just makes everything worse. Way downfield. That's trouble. Oh. Yeah. Bro. I'm not going to lie. Bro got some hidden speed on him, bro. Do you see how he's cutting off that ball? Bro is making a break. Way downfield. Down That's trouble. The Gene read that thing I'm from sure a Iowa mile also that's a good little away. Linebacker too, as well. We've seen that a lot throughout the year, not making the contested catches on the I've deep ball. Uh, ball fired outside. This is intercepted this time. And down oh, the sideline bro. goes to Gene. He is maker. so dangerous for turning these interceptions, punts, you name it. Inside the five, he goes. And remember, he had five interceptions last year. Three of those returned for touchdowns. Lucky just to get yeah, him on five the five interceptions last year. Three returned for touchdowns. Kim will go to the air on first down. Kim fires towards the end zone, overthrew it, and Cooper DeGene was there for the interception. Such a receiver on all of these plays, literally. <laughs> like a to start. Imagine him, but you could easily play him across from Tariq Woolen, bro. You could play him inside, have Devin Spoon across from Tariq Woolen. You could have him at safety next to Julian Love while we have Tariq and Spoon on the outside. Uh, Reek and the Trey Brown We can have Spoon on the inside I'm not going to lie Picking him up Could make our Secondary two versus Third five. quarter Two versus five. Deckers Going for the end zone and He's a safety That's a safety play, Deckers He can play safety bro Rain to start In the third quarter You see this Deckers Going for the end zone He must be a safety Center Center be, Center Center Picked zone. off by Cooper DeGene Leading rusher number two is Vitella, the older brother of Toa Tala, who's the running backs coach. Illingworth under pressure and throws the ball away, and they're going to say this is an interception along the sideline for Iowa. That's in high school. Lincolnshire, north of Chicago, looking for Charlie Jones. What's new? That is now officially the fifth target. It's the my next time one, that O'Connell has thrown to Jones. What that's about? Stroud. In trouble, breaks a tackle, looking, throws, end zone, broke it up, in the end zone. It's against C.J. Stroud too, folks, I already know about him. Wimson, plenty of time, he'll fire high, and that's it, complete. Pressure comes. Looking across the middle, and that falls incomplete. There is no penalty marker. They blocked the punt already. I'm fucking with, bro, he's physical. Lunovich ran into a bit there. He and they got him at returner, bro. Who, like, 
Yeah, that's just electric to me. Down to the 20 yard line. All he does is make plays. <laughs> that's, it. that's what I'm saying, bro. That's literally what I'm saying, bro. Every clip I've seen from this man, he's making a play. And I can't be mad at him. Play action for Mordecai. And Making he'll throw to the far side. And DeGene. Field goal. Here's Stroud. Lobs it. Stroud too. Incomplete. That's JSN 2, man. That's JSN 2. What you know about him? Lobs it. Incomplete. No flag on the play. Smith and Jigba, the intended receiver. Cooper DeGene. In passing over 300 yards of total offense last week, had that ball tipped and nearly intercepted. Tipped at the line of scrimmage, and Cooper DeGene got close to getting his hands on that one. For Iowa State. Back to throw, got it over the middle, and nothing there. Jalen Knoll overrun by DeGene again. From Campbell. Backs it up. Like, that's one thing I can see with his game, but he's definitely an intuitive player. Like his intuition. He's going off of that shit. He's an instinctual player, I should say. Not intuitive. Instinctual player. And that's what I feel like our team is moving towards. A more instinctual defense. A more, you know what I'm saying? You see it, you react to it type, type defense. Flying to the ball, physical. Man, I, I fuck with him if you pick him, bro. I hope he chase back. Back to him. throw. Man. Got it over the middle and nothing there. Like Jalen Knoll overrun by Dejean again. From Campbell. Bents it up in there. They back off it. Wade. Downfield wants a flag, no flagging complete, and that was to Gene on Brown. I would Came into the ball game among to others, me. and it's a counter handoff. To Gene is five. back there. One yard line. Sullivan run it again, and he was wrapped up before he got to the five. That'll be a loss. Cooper to Gene, the quarterback. Iowa showing pressure from the far side. They will hand it off. Stifle it on the first chance. Beck tries to throw a block, and that's not going anywhere. DeGene stayed right with Norton. Tries to throw a block. The spoon's making that tackle that first. Died. They will hand it off. Stifle it on the first chance. Beck tries to throw a block, and that's not going like anywhere. DeGene stayed right with Norton. Being out since four or five drives today. Not this time. There we go. Allen can't go anywhere. Refusing to give up is Cooper Jean. <clears throat> Brenda trying to find the Ooh. outside. Is Cooper DeGene everywhere? Blake Lock under five. Sitkowski looking right the entire time. We get Cooper DeGene next to Witherspoon, bro. That is dangerous. Brown, there's Cooper DeGene. It's literally dangerous, bro. Cooper DeGene back to receive. And he fields it inside by the five-yard line. Cutting it out left side. Kinnick Stadium getting a little bit of life here in this return. Cooper DeGene shaking. The safety put point. I know white boy can make a move. Short throw trying to make something happen out of the He's a to him. He's a hit to him. yards. Get back to running the ball. That was a soft snap. Almost a changeup that time. Don't 10. A.J. Henning is back. He ran one back. Earlier this year against Connecticut, he'll start from the 20. He plays both sides of special teams. Back. You want he a player like this. Back. I'm not going to lie, folks. You want a player like this, regardless where he's going to play. He's going to put on the special teams. And regardless how he plays on defense, he's going to put on the special teams. So you're going to be, he's going to be used, used regardless. He's clearly a cornerback. You, you're drafting him as a corner, you know what I'm saying? You're, you're drafting him for his corner ability. But at the, end, at the end of the day, if you got somebody who can make plays on special teams as well, who's willing to provide to the team, that's a W pick. Man. Earlier this a year against pick. Connecticut, yeah, more we'll start from the 21 and get chopped down that's immediately. Right get a beat on the path of the ball. We may not have heard the last of him, though. Clips. This punt is a low trajectory one taken off the bounce by Redding. Wow. And down he goes uh, immediately. DeGene down there again. The chance here, he had a 45-yarder called back in the first quarter, then they punted out of bounds. And now he lets that one hit, picks it up late. Ooh. Let's see what he can come up with. Not a whole lot. Ooh. Yeah, man, that's it for the highlights, I guess, bro. I'm fucking with Cooper DeGene, I can't lie. I wasn't familiar to his game before the vid, but I wouldn't be mad if he was a future Seahawk, man. Make sure to let me know down in the comments, man, what team y'all think Cooper DeGene gonna go to? Y'all think it's going to be nice in the, the little NFL, man? 
Y'all make sure to let me know, man. Leave any suggestions in the comments. Y'all already know, man. It's the Fade to Dizzy.